You know, I remember it like it was yesterday. The year 2000. The summer of 2000, actually. I was visiting my grandparents in Grand Bank, Newfoundland. I had taken a boat ride, and I was wearing orange pants for some reason. Anyway, I went to the video store, I saw this game called Final Fantasy 3, and I remember thinking, if Final Fantasy 7 came out in 1997, and Final Fantasy 3 came out in 1994, how did they fit three whole games in between that gap? I actually thought that. Yes, this is actually Final Fantasy 6, but that doesn't matter. What matters is that I took this thing home, plunked it into the Super Nintendo, and on a 10-inch TV in a tiny basement in Grand Bank, Newfoundland, I saw this. A fiery logo with thunderstorms and beautiful piano. Just a sense of foreboding. This was something special. It was the first RPG I ever really played. Well, unless you count Super Mario RPG, which I rented briefly in that very same basement in 1996, but this had a whole other effect on teenage me, as most Final Fantasy games do when you're of that age. I mean, ask any kid when he was like 13 when Final Fantasy VII came out. And, whoa. I didn't have a PS1 in 1997, but I had a Super Nintendo in 2000. And this is what I saw. Foreboding, foreshadowing, and a sense of impending doom with cloister bells. Just this ominous nature. A frozen city within the mountains. Holy God, what have I rented here? I was still a little disoriented from the boat ride and all. I mean, it's a nice boat ride, but still. What is this? What am I even looking at? And I didn't catch that little glimpse out of the corner of my eye just there. But little did I know that this would lead me on a crazy adventure. I would attempt to buy the game from these people, but to no avail. When I came back, later in the summer of 2000, I played it again. And then in 2001 and 2002, I played even more and rented it for five days straight and almost beat the damn thing. But then it was gone. Until I bought the advanced version on another trip to Grand Bank, Newfoundland, but that's another story for another time. For now, since I can't press any buttons, I leave you here, on a high mountaintop cliff, with wind blowing. There's the city. The city of Narsh, or Narshe, however you want to say it. Still, this was the opening to Final Fantasy III on the Super Nintendo. Final Fantasy VI. And this has been Week 5 of the Let's Play Summer School 2. Goodbye, sweethearts.